do you want to find alternative places to camp because RV parks and campgrounds are filled up or just want some variety? I'm going to show you all about Hip Camp, a resource where you can find unique places to camp, such as a hut built into the side of a mountain, sleep in a covered wagon in the middle of nowhere, camp and lend a hand to a farm or at an alpaca rescue farm, do some off-grid tent camping on a river, camp on a ranch overlooking Zion National Park or an old brownstone quarry with natural springs, or choose a place to camp with sweeping mountain views to get away from it all. Hi Weekend Warrior family, or if you're new here, I'm Randy. And every Thursday, I share tips to help us make every moment count, because weekends are just too short. So what exactly is Hip Camp? Think Airbnb for camping. Hip Camp works with landowners to offer RV and tent camping, cabins, tree houses, and glamping, everywhere from national parks to blueberry farms. Hip Camp has over 431,000 campsites around the U.S., so you can find places to camp nearby you or for your next camping trip. Hip Camp has something for everyone. You can camp with your RV or your tent or without one. You can search for places to camp on their website or via their iOS or their Android app. I'll leave links to the Hip Camp website along with the Android and the iOS apps in the video description below. Let's do a search. Let's search in Utah. Let's pretend we live in Utah or we're going to be visiting Utah. We'll leave the dates blank for now. I own an RV, so I'm looking for a site that will accommodate RV sites, so I'm going to check that one and then we'll hit search. There are a total of 361 results. On the right hand side is a map with the campsite results and on the left is a quick glance of each campsite. When we scroll back to the top, we've got more options and more filters available to us. We'll click on the more filters button and we can search by group size. I love this. We can find sites that'll accommodate almost any size group. Next, let's filter by price and I'm gonna select under $50. Let's check that we want to park at the site. We don't want to come by boat or by horse. Under amenities, I'm going to select that pets are allowed. We've got to bring princess. And I love my campfires, so let's make sure that we can build a campfire. I don't need a toilet because we are self-contained. Under activities, my favorite thing is hiking. Let's make sure that there's hiking around and let's look and see what our other options are. Oh, wow, there's really a lot of fun activity options. Also, we can search if there's a lake or beach or a forest or even a cave nearby. All right, looks like we've got 56 options available to us, but I decided that I want to see what's available with Wi-Fi. So let's check that. And now we've got five listings to view. At a glance, all five of these results look really interesting. Let's take a closer look at LZJ Ranch's Hiawatha hideout pictures. To learn more about this Hip Camp campsite, let's click on it. By clicking the arrows next to the photos, we can see even more photos. This looks like a really cool place to camp at that offers horseback riding and epic views. Each campsite page offers a wealth of information about that campsite. And it looks like at this one, you can have up to 20 guests per site. The camping vehicle details section offers essential information. It'll tell you information like are there hookups available and the maximum length of RV that the site will accommodate. And here's what can really make your camping experiences unique. Each campsite host can offer optional things to purchase that can really make your experiences truly one of a kind. When camping at the LZJ Ranch's Hiawatha Hideout, you can purchase a guided horseback trail ride or listen to local music and folktales that will have you laughing to tears in awe of what has happened here. The next section shows you activities offered at the Hip Camp host property or nearby. At a glance, you'll also see the natural features found at each camping spot. You can also see the property elevation, the current temperature, and how far away this property is located from your current location. I think this is smart. Hip Camp displays nearby national parks and state parks. Not only does this show you nearby things to do, but also provides alternative places to camp if a campground is full or you just want to avoid campground crowds. 
and very important, Hip Camp campsite reviews. Reading what previous campers have to say can provide great insights, so you know what to expect. Next, I'm going to show you how to make a hip camp reservation and other useful tools. But first, I love hip camp because the more resources we have to find campsites, the less we have to stress about finding places to camp. Well, next week I have another alternative source to find unique places to camp and it's almost free. You are going to want to watch this video. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, do so now by hitting the red subscribe button located right below this video. And don't forget to hit the bell. By hitting the bell, you'll be notified when that video goes live. A convenient hip camp feature is the ability to create and save lists of places to camp that are interesting to you. For example, I'm headed to Texas soon and have a couple of extra days, so I'm looking for places to stay along the route. Oh my gosh, look at these waterfalls. I want to create a list of possible places to camp during my upcoming trip and add this campsite to it. To do this, click on the Save to List button. I've already created some lists, but I want to add a new one for this trip, so I'll click on the Create a New List. Then give your list a name and this campsite will be saved to your new list. Then to view any of your saved lists, simply click on the Saves on the upper right hand corner. And this is a page of all your created saved lists, including the list that I just created for my upcoming trip. To view a list, click on the list to see all of your hip camp saved places. Making a hip camp reservation is done right from the campsite page. If the button says instant book, click on that and enter your dates. Then follow the rest of the checkout process. If the button says request to book, the process is similar, except for the campsite owner has 24 hours to respond to you. If you want to learn the easiest way to find the best campgrounds at national parks, state parks, RV parks, state and county parks, I'll leave a link to a video that I did right up here and in the video description below that explains how I avoid bad campgrounds using the Allstays app. This is my go-to app to find traditional campgrounds, so be sure to watch that next. Well, that's it for this episode and I can't wait to see you next Thursday.